Bougainville Police for the last three months ran an operation called Challenger in which offenders throughout the region were apprehended and locked up in police holding cells in Buin, Arawa and Buka, respectively. In an exclusive phone interview with MTV News today, Chief of Bougainville Police, Francis Tokura, explained further on this pressing issue currently being faced in the region. We've got a lot of um, suspects locked up in the, or offenders locked up in the cells at uh, Buka Police Station uh, in Arawa and in, also in Buin. During the operations, we have picked up a lot of suspects who were involved in the Rambits at the Arab police station. And because of the cells in Arab was uh, damaged during the Rambits, we have to transport all the suspects who were uh, picked up in relation to the Rambits at Arab police station up to Buka police station because it's much bigger. Uh, it was recently renovated. In- Chief Tokura further explained that this initiative is part of strengthening policing partnerships with the locals to take ownership in curbing law and order issues. He explained that all cells are overcrowded with accused and suspects beyond their actual holding capacity. According to Chief Tokura, the Buin police holding cell is run down with health workers recently condemning the facility. When asked about the Arawa and Buka cells condition, this was Chief Tokura's response. And because of the cells in Arab was uh, damaged during the rampage, we have to transport all the suspects who were uh, picked up in relation to the rampage at Arab police station up to Buka police station because it's much bigger. Uh, it was recently renovated and it's much bigger. It can hold uh, a, lo- a, lo- a few more suspects. MTV News understands the Pecot Rehabilitation Precinct Center in North Bougainville is run down and cannot host inmates. For the refurbishment and maintenance of each of these police holding cells is now over to the autonomous Bougainville government to make this a priority. Lindy Suharupa, National MTV News.